recommend starting and stopping at standby phases for the most part, but I think I'll go ahead and start this one. And if it does end up getting to be too long, then I may stop midway. I'm sorry I made you all worry. Are you all right? I'm fine, and we have to hurry back to the Kunad Gate. Okay. Going back there again? Do you know what we can do about it, Mother? Yes. We must get rid of the entanglements in the Kunad Gate, or the world will eventually be destroyed. Entanglements? What are they? Oh, we should this head part. to the Kunad Gate before I explain it further. Okay. Then we'll go to the Kunad Highway. Everyone get ready. Mom, you can have a seat here. Thank you. You got so big. Huh? <laughs> that was sudden. You joined the OSF. How's Kaito? Are you getting along with your older brother? You do He's not get good. along with your older brother. We don't really get along anymore. Oh. Can you tell me what's happening in your time, in the present? And that's basically it. The only other thing is the existence of the Kunad Gate. Thank you. Along with Babe's data, I think I understand a lot now. Are we almost ready to leave? Oh, yeah. We are. Uh, Mom? You're just like your father. Huh? No. Kaito is the one who looks like Dad. Actually, people tell me I'm not much like him. Yeah, Kaito's probably I'm a lot like him. about now. your face. It's how you act. You don't... Sure about that? About your father... I'm sorry I didn't tell you what he was doing. He did awful things, but it was him that saved me from Togetsu. He was kind. Oh. Are you sure that how you act thing is a great comparison? He's wanted to be a politician ever since he was little. But I guess he could only take your father's path as well. Kaito did, but I... It's all right. You and Kaito are your fathers and my children. I know you'll make up someday. Right. Things are moving fast, but I'm hoping you can tell us how to deal with the Kunad Gate. You said something about entanglement? Ultimately, Yuito and Kasane have to enter the Kunad Gate and unravel the entanglements. What I'm telling you here is just a concept. The traces interfering with time should look like tangled red threads. According to Togetsu's theory, whenever you jump through time, a dimensional hole like the Kunad Gate is created, but it should then disappear. The reason this hasn't disappeared is because Yuito and Kasane's powers resonated. The Kunad Gate is different from the theorized gates in that it's persisting in a distorted state. Using a distorted gate for a time jump creates entanglements. If you can unravel those entanglements, you can close the Kunad Gate. Distorted? I don't really get it yet. But when you say, enter the Kunad Gate, do you mean go into that hole in the sky? That strange space. Is it inside the Kunad Gate? You saw it too, when the gate first opened. Oh, that place with all the weird images? That's right. That strange space that Kasane mentioned exists inside the Kunad Gate. It is a concept of space that only exists for those with the Red String's power. Togetsu called it the Kronos Terminal. Perhaps it's a kind of station, or junction point, for traveling through time. Hmm. So only Yuito and Kasane can perceive it. I guess that explains why we didn't notice it when we jumped to the future. When there is time contact between 2020, when the gate was made, and another time, entanglements are created. Time.
time contact? Is that any different from time travel? Mm. It's a broader definition of time travel. Even if you don't arrive at that time, even if you just attempt, basically, if someone with the red string's power even touches that time, there is a trace. That is time contact. The only way to actually so see even if you just have entanglements like look at a time you to go and check for yourselves. So I guess the only thing we can do is leave it to Yuito and Kasane. Even if we find the entanglements, we won't know how to unravel them until we see them. The Kronos Terminal is conceptualized by your powers, so you'll know how to unravel them. Not with reason, but with intuition. Also, I'm weak, but I can use and with strings, gameplay. <laughs> so I'll support you from here. Okay. So we just need to use the red strings again and enter the Kronos term. So it's either I'm going to be hitting it or pressing a button. With you, this time. you don't know what kind of dangers will be there. Make sure you're ready before you go. If it gets dangerous, you both come right back. Don't worry, we will. Just take care of my mother. Keep her safe. It's all right. Don't worry. We will protect Wakana. All right, we don't have much time. Let me know when you're ready. Mom. We're starting something very Sorry, telling. Yuito, Kasane, Kyoka, Wakane, and kind of Kagero all have red eyes. Kagero is only one of them, but still, everyone connected. To to get to at least it seems, at the very least, has some sort of red eye association. Good to go, Kasane. I'm ready. Focus your consciousness together. Picture the site of the Kronos Terminal. To the Kronos Terminal. We will unravel those entanglements. Is SAS gonna be active or no? It looks like we actually made it. Are each of those images connected to different times? We can't Don't just stand touch around. anything we have to search for the except for the ones you already <laughs> made. I guess it's nothing new when it's your third time. So, how do we find them? I don't feel anything yet. This is. It must be mother. Is she guiding us? Let's go. Others? How are they inside the Kronos terminal? Calm down. That place is built from your consciousness. It's an imaginary world. It is a very unstable place. Your fear and anxiety, all of your emotions affect it. The memories of your past made others appear. So your memories of so others created others in others this space. By our mental immaturity. <laughs> that makes us sound pretty lame. But if we made them, we can take them down too. I know the two of you can handle it, but be careful. And SAS is active. Is this under an illusion? It sure looks real. As long as your brain thinks so, it's the same as if it was. We have to fight it. Leave it to me! It's over! Here we go! Here's my strength! This is bad. Do this. 
going on? Oh, it did hit. I didn't think it would hit from below. Good. Hey, do you feel something? Okay, now just follow the flowers. It's weird. This is the old OSF hospital on that day in 2009. It's an entanglement. Yeah. This one's the very last it, one you did. It. This is definitely it. If we want to successfully unravel this, then I'm betting that we have to use the red strings, our power. Yes, I feel it too. We should be able to make this work. Yeah. Another one! Let's hold After you take care of a wave of others. Different L2 up here. Then let's get off the lock on this. God damn it. Can you pay attention? This. And this. This should work. Is that it? This will make the Kunad Gate disappear. Hey, Kasane. That day, I never got the chance to thank you properly. So, thank you for saving me. What? Well, that came out of nowhere. You were the one that saved me 11 years ago at the hospital, right? I remember it perfectly now. I, I feel used like we're to be having a, dud, a very similar conversation. Powers. My power awakening? I think it was because you shared yours with me. What? Powers aren't something you can just share. Yeah, I know what I'm saying sounds silly, but if it were possible, it was thanks to meeting you that day that I'm still alive, and have reached my goal of getting into the OSF. That's what I think, so... Thanks for saving me. You're welcome. Is that what I'm supposed to say? <laughs> you look totally confused, but that's okay. I think it's unraveled now. Everyone is probably worried about us. Mother's power. I can still feel it. So, there's more than one entanglement? If so, it's simple. We just have to unravel all of them. Right. We did travel more than once. We did unravel that entanglement, right? I think so. But something still feels off. So you feel it too? Something's bothering me. Seto. Someone who literally didn't serve his fate in all of this. There's 
Here's another one. Is that 50 years in the future? That should be gone. Eh? This is the other that attacked you and killed. Double shit. Leave it to me, Gemma. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Literally went for the opposite. And you untangle one of the gate things and stuff. Great. Having it all. Having too many things on one button. Damn it. Get over here. Which time was that? Shit, I didn't look. I think that's all of them. Have you ever thought of what you do? If you could change history? You mean by traveling to the past? That would just create new entanglements though, wouldn't it? I mean, after the Kunat gate is gone. What happened to the rule of threes? If you could use the red strings freely. Or unless that's just... Well, yeah. All of them for this I mean, one. sure, I've thought about it. If I had done this or hadn't done that, something would have changed. All those regrets are still there. When Nagi asked, what should I have done differently? I just couldn't come up with an answer. So, do you want to use the red strings to change the past? Mm. No, I don't. Because even if you change the past, you won't know how it will affect the future. Nagi might not have gotten caught up in all of this if he wasn't my friend. If he hadn't joined the OSF, if he didn't admire them, if I mess with the past that much and just overwrite his life, is that really saving him? And it's not just Nagi. If you change the past, it would affect the lives of everyone in the world. It's not something that one person can burden themselves with. I don't think it's right to only care about what you wish. There's a lot that I still can't accept. But it's not something that I can just ignore as if it didn't happen. I know it was a silly question. I'm actually surprised. Or maybe I'm just relieved. Because now I know I'm not the only one having these thoughts. Oh. Before, I would have answered differently. But now that I've met everyone, the way I see the world has changed. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's the same for me. You know, we actually have a lot in common. I think it's a little early to say that. Yeah. I think you have quite a bit in common. This is Mom's... There's still an entanglement? But all the time periods we traveled to... No. Now's not the time to think about it. Can you keep going? I'll be okay. I'm probably just a little tired from using my brain too much. We should hurry. Will we travel to those two times? Yeah. Right? Wait, yes, so there was the origin the point of when the Gnotic Gate was open. And then the time that they purposely used it. So this one is the Sumeragi Crest. Mm. That's it. This is the image I saw at the start. Right. Yakima Sumeragi's crest. It seems like a time entanglement appeared then. Maybe when they touch the time? Karen? Wow. 
What are you doing? Oh. Former Major General Karin. So they're going to keep coming. We need to unravel the entire. Sorry, I saved. Can I use field? <laughs> yes. Cool. I saved it first. Guess. With my power. Expected enemies to spawn as in between me completing these L2s. Done? Done? Okay, that should. You yes. though? This is bad. I don't think I can take much more either. Okay, so, Kasane's out of it. Did we do it? That should be all of them, right? Probably, but something doesn't feel right. Karin and Yakumo Sumeragi. What happened to them? <sighs> Damn it. I'm blacking. You don't, 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 don't stay awake. <laughs> Mom? Mother. Stay conscious, at least. Where am I? Oh, good. You're awake. It seems like we made it back. What's going on? The Kunad Gate. Why hasn't it disappeared? Well... Good job, you two. It's all okay now. What? But... Mother, we unraveled the entanglements. So why? <sighs> Leave the rest to me. What? Hmm? Thank you for growing up so strong. You've made a lot of wonderful friends. Those connections are much more valuable than any red string. Treasure them for the rest of your life. M mother? Mom, you can't go back to the past. If you go back, Toketsu will. It has to be done. Forgive me. The longer I remain here, the more painful it will be. <sighs> no, hold on! There's still so much that I need to say! Mother! <laughs> Yuito! Kasane! Live on! Knowing you're happy is all that I could ask for! She returns after the attack. So today is the day. I may give you my brain, 
But you can't have my memories of the future. Kaito. Yuito. Kasane. This is some time paradoxy shit. The only way she can get their memories of get those memories of going there or Kasane going to that oof oh I should try to make sense of time travel I like this game on the second playthrough a lot of it falls apart <laughs> sensically you kind of just roll with it the first time <laughs> been confirmed as the target Wakana. Current theory for cause of death is cerebral overload due to a malfunction in the personality rehabilitation device. We believe an irreversible memory wipe was conducted. There is significant damage to the memory regions in her brain. Following protocol... Oh, so she went to the memory rehabilitation stuff just to remove those memories and that's when... And Togetsu found her. There was an entanglement from so that's how she kept traveled. Togetsu from learning of the things in the future. Us earlier when the two of you were gone. The Kunad Gate wouldn't Particularly about them she was still kind of shutting time. down. We have a message she left for the two of you. Let me send it to you now. Okay. This one I will go ahead and read. In what kind of okay? I'm sorry, we have to part like this. Ah! I should have told you what I was trying to do, but I didn't trust myself to be calm before talking to you two. I'll summarize what I told your friends. I'm going back back to my time now. No, I should say I went back. There are three reasons. One, to protect the history of Wakane Sumeragi dying in 2009. Two, to ensure the history where I received the red strings data sent to by Togetsu. Togetsu sent the data to me because they salvaged my brain and connected me to Babe. So my brain has to be connected by Togetsu in 2009. Three, to erase the entanglement I created. If someone with the red strings power or who is from a different time than you two passes through the Kanata gate, Entanglement is created. As long as you try to pass through the Kronos Terminal, the entanglement can't be eliminated. My death eliminates the power error and cause, so the entanglement can be erased. That means I have to carry out my life in my original form. I've been this I've had this plan ever since I received the Red Strings data. This will eliminate the Kanata Gate. What happens to the world after that is left you living in 2020. Please work with your friends to make a better future. P.S. I know I must have hurt you both, but I was happy that I was able to see my precious children grow up and strong. Precious children grown up and strong. Thank you for being born and for living, for giving me happiness. I pray that that you will see so much more happiness than what you gave me. Yuito Kasane, I will love you always. Wakane Sumaragi. Wakane knew from the start that she was causing an entanglement. Yeah. I'm sorry. I know this hits the two of you harder than anyone else, and I'm here crying. Whew. <sighs> Nothing. Wakana wasn't from this time period, so her situation was different than yours. Hey, um, don't be so down. I'm not saying that because I'm worried about you. I said that because it affects Platoon. I know she would have wanted to talk to the both of you some more. 
But she thought spending more time with you would only make things more painful. Apparently, the entanglement will unravel. Probably, and put more risk on things. And dies like messing up. History. She held back her feelings so she could part with you with no regrets. She's a great person. The uneasy feeling I had when we unraveled the entanglements 11 years ago was because Mother's entanglement still remained. That's strange. Wakana has returned, so how come it didn't disappear? Have all the entanglements truly been unraveled? All the entanglements we felt we unraveled. The ones 11 years ago. 50 years, 50 in, the years future, in the future. And wonder. the one during Yakumo Sumeragi's time period. What? What does Yakumo Sumeragi's time period have to do with anything? I think one formed when we witnessed Yakumo's assassination. What are you talking about? Yakumo was severely injured in an accident, but he wasn't assassinated. It looked like an assassination. Either, but we saw Yakumo Sumeragi being killed by Karin. What did you say? We were busy dealing with the entanglement, but yeah. There's no doubt in my mind that that was former Major General Karin. He copied Kasane's power. Yuito, if he also copied your power. But he didn't He's copy He's been mine. using the gate. He yeah, did. time travel by resonating Kasane's power with mine. So it hasn't disappeared because of the entanglement Karin created when he traveled back to Yakumo's time period? But the two of you could But you unraveled the entanglement. How do you expect to unravel something you can't find? Karin can unravel his own entanglement. Yes, exactly. The only thing we can do is take Karin to the Kronos terminal and have him unravel the entanglement himself. Wataru, can you check Karin's location? I figured you'd ask, so I've been working on it. I've got nothing. I can't find him at all. It's like he's disappeared. Supposing that he's traveled to Yakumo's time period, that would mean he's in the past. That's where you're going to find him. Are you too sure the people you saw were really Karin and Yakumo? We're sure. We could see their faces clearly. Actually, we only saw Karin's face. But that was Yakumo. I mean, he had the same mask on as all the depictions of him. Ah, uh, yes, that's it, the mask. That explains everything. Hmm. Okay. Kagura, explain. Whoa, Sugumi, calm down. So, you know how Yakumo started wearing the mask because of the injuries he sustained? Rumor was, sometime after the accident, he suddenly stopped appearing in front of people and his whole personality just changed. Whole personality changed? You're not suggesting... The real Yakumo there was, was assassinated swap? by Karin from the future, and Karin took his place by putting on the mask? It doesn't matter. Either way, we still need to travel back to 2,000 years ago to check. Actually... No, we might not have to travel at all. You all saw my brother's video, right? Don't you remember what he said? <laughs> Yakumo Sumeragi is alive! What are you... Okay. He is asleep, deep beneath Suo. Even now, he is waiting for his revenge. Right. Cold sleep. Just like Kagero. If Yakumo is in cold sleep under Suo, then we can find out the truth so by meeting him directly. That's where Karen is? If former Major General Karin replaced him, then he'll be the one down there in cold sleep. That must he must have disappeared to there after it. grabbing it from Yuito and our body. Help us unravel the entanglement. Do we know where he's sleeping though? I thought I he was mean, jumping back and forth a bit more. I can think of but I guess it was just a straight shot. I mean, Sumeraki tomb is the first place I thought of where Yakumo would be. Do you think he would really be in such a heavily trafficked place though? How about or at least that's where he ended up. It's your family's tomb. 
Yeah, that makes sense. But I've never even been inside the building before. The head of the family is responsible for watching over Sumeragi tomb. I might be able to find something out if I talk to my brother. The chief, do you think he'll listen to us? I Actually, don't think he will. I've been trying to reach my brother's terminal, but I'm not getting through. There's a chance he might have blocked me. Wataru, can you ask Major General Fubuki to talk to my brother? I doubt he'd refuse a call from a Major General. Okay, leave it to me. I just don't know how soon I'll get a response. Wanna stop by our hideout then? I'm sure Yuito and Kasane could use the rest. Good idea. It would be smart to rest while we can. Wait, was that it? Thanks, Gemma. All right, let's head back. Normally, hideout means we're entering standby phase. Welcome back. I messaged Major General Fubuki. He Thanks, Wataru. I also asked about Major General Karin, but apparently Major General Fubuki doesn't know anything either. I see. Then I guess he really is in the past. We don't have any other when? leads at the moment. Yeah, so he must have done that. But I always thought he was going back and forth. Okay, yeah, that actually went much faster. So there's actually only one more chapter after this. Which, actually, that's actually super perfect. Let me go through and see what gifts... I'm pretty sure the last chapter is fairly long, and it's definitely going to be harder, so. Okay. Last one is Kasane, which I think she's over here. Yep. Good timing. Will you go to Kikuchiba with me? Yeah, sure. Why Kikuchiba? I thought we could go somewhere to talk like when we went to Mizuhogawa. We won't need lunch. I just want to talk. Oh, got it. No lunch, huh? I guess that was too much last time. Oh! Well, this one has some combat to it. Just a tiny bit, it seems, though. Hey, do you remember when we came here together before? A lot has happened since then. Before? When was that? When you don't remember? Looking for Seto's you asked me if there was anyone I liked. wasn't it? You know, when we went looking for Captain Seto's family. Oh, good pen. lord, okay. You said you were doing a background check. Oh, that. Back then? I had no idea that we'd get caught up in something that involved the whole world. Not just us, but everyone around us, too. It's nothing we could have expected. You're right. Hey, sorry to interrupt. Two large groups of others were confirmed near you. There are a lot of them. More than you usually see around there. It shouldn't be a problem for you two, but be careful. So, how should we go about this? Let's split up. We can work more efficiently that way. All right. I'll go this way. I'll contact you when I've cleaned most of them up. I'm counting on you. <sighs> Wataru wasn't joking. That sure is a lot. I hope Kasane is okay. Oh. There's more of them than I thought. How are things with you, Yuito? Kasane? What's going on? Wataru, what's the situation? Hmm? Damn, I can't get through. Is the network down? I can't even use SAS. Uh... Calm down. 
it's all right. I can do Network this. Network is feeling unreliable. The Wi-Fi dropped. <laughs> Oh, I just noticed things are actually in level with me right now. is acting up <laughs> again Watch me be wrong. Hi. What? I hit the outer shell. I think I can break it if I focus my attacks. fall over like that. Go Sonic. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. I feel like I need to just use this more. Nice. 
don't. this if we attack together let's do this It was a close one. It was? I wasn't really all that worried. I assumed you would act when you did. <laughs> I was nervous. I guess we can work together even without SAS. I don't think I could have pulled it off with someone else. Thank you for getting the timing right. <laughs> it's nice to hear a compliment from you. You're always so harsh. Am I? Well, whatever. Let's make our way to the top. We can see the moon from here. It's beautiful. I can so, actually see the moon. I thought the extinction belt blocked it. When the so maybe it's over, clearer at times? To do? I have a vague idea. It might be too grand, so you'll probably laugh. I won't laugh, no matter what it is. Thanks. I want to change the world. Change the world? Yeah. We've both seen a lot of bad things in this country. The world that we live in now is built on so much sadness and sacrifice. That's true. Suo, Seiron, and Togetsu. There were people suffering everywhere. So many people's lives were turned upside down because of the desire for the strongest power. We're using powers to alter time. It's got to end. This world can't exist just for powers. I won't let what happened to Nagi happen to anyone else. That's the least I can do for him. That's why I want to change the world. To make it a place where people don't have to rely on powers for everything. I know it will take a long time, but I feel like as a dud, I'm the perfect person for it. A dud, that's right. How's your head? They were saying you might lose your power. No big change at the moment. But if it really comes down to it, I'm prepared to become one again. You're pretty calm about it. The way you were talking, I thought you would be a little depressed. I mean, it will be inconvenient. But you know what? I'm not the least bit afraid. I thought the same thing when the network went down. Like I was fighting back to back with you, even without SAS. You thought the same thing? I wonder if that's what it feels like to lose your power. We're not just connected by SAS. Even if we can't see each other's faces or hear each other's voices, the most important thing, our connection, doesn't go away. So I'll be all right. That's good. When we first met, I honestly thought I wouldn't be able to count on you in a fight. <laughs> I kind of had a feeling you thought that. Brutal as always. You're different now. I think you really can change the world. Thank you. Don't mention it. I'm relieved as well. I feel like I can leave this world to you. Leave? What are you planning to do? Well, I haven't decided on a clear goal yet. But I've sort of been thinking of something outside this world. Like, outside of New Himuka? You mean the moon? I've been thinking about it ever since I heard humanity came here from the moon. Outside this world is another world that I know nothing about, filled with people who are a mystery to me. They're suffering, just like the people here. They are attacked by others, and turning into them. 
Once I realized that, I couldn't ignore it. I thought maybe I could help somehow. The moon. I thought I understood the first time I heard about it. But the scale is just too big. It doesn't seem real at all. I certainly never thought about saving the people that live there. You really are amazing. I'm not amazing at all. I just don't want to regret neglecting the people I could have protected. I always felt that you were the kind of person that would step up to protect people, even if you're alone. It's almost as if you're not afraid of anything. I looked up to you when I was a kid. I wanted to be just like you. To be fair, you tell me. you and you're giving me looked up to the idea of Kasane like from before. a brief moment. The most important connections never go away. You mean Naomi? Not just her. The memories of my mother. And the time I spent with all of you. The only reason I'm not as afraid as I should be is because I know they'll always be with me. I know that they'll always be here, inside my heart. So, even if you're alone, you're never really alone? I kind of like that. That's why I feel like I can go anywhere, even going beyond the sky. <laughs> I know that sounds like a dream. I think you can do it. No. I know you can. Thank you. So, it looks like you and I will be going our separate ways. It won't just be us. You will be fixing your thing. It's here. Drift farther Kasane apart. will be shooting for the moon. Yeah. I'd be lying if I said it didn't make me sad. But even apart, we're still friends. Yeah. Okay. We should probably get back to the hideout. There's so much to do before and after a fight. We just have to take care of what's in front of us. Though, listening to you made me excited for the future. It won't be easy for either of us, so let's do our best. Both in our own places. Absolutely. I promise I'll make a better future, no matter how long it takes. You can take your time, but if you take too long... I'll bring peace to the moon and come back before you're done. Oh, so it's a competition now. I know you hate to lose. Oh, hold on a second. I have something for you. Take this. For me? Is this a braided strap? I tried making it like the hair clip Naomi made for me a long time ago. Her hair clip supported me through the tough times. So you really are a big sister, Kasane. I'm not as good as her, but I think it looks somewhat decent. I think it's great. And the fact that you made it makes it even better. Thank you. I'll hold on to it forever. I'm so glad you like it. I really wanted you to have that. You were always a strange existence to me. You always went a different way. Had different ideas. Even when we were enemies. When I was trying to kill you, you still tried to talk to me. Well, I didn't want to die, and I didn't want you to die either. Seeing that helped change my mind. Now, I don't think anyone should have to be sacrificed. So to put it simply, you're someone I needed in my life. <sighs> I saw you in the future, and you were different. You were covered in scars, and were taking everything on yourself. Damn, it sounds like I wasn't doing that well. Mm -hmm. You were a sad person who didn't mind sacrificing himself. I don't want you to end up like that. I don't want that to be your future. And I don't want you thinking it's okay to throw your own life away. So when you see those red strings... Remember that no matter when or where I am, I want you to live on. I'll never forget. I promise. That's all I wanted to talk about. Let's get going. I'm actually gonna stay for a while. See you back at the hideout? Sure. See you then. Changing new Himuka? That's not gonna be so easy. It's okay. It's not scary. I can keep going, even if I'm alone. Okay. Let's do this.
There's a lot that I wish hadn't happened, but I'm grateful I met you, Yuito. <laughs> well, I am your Baki, after all. <laughs> <laughs> I did say that. I think of you now as a comrade. We'd understand each other even if we were far apart. At least I think we would. And okay, well, active second is to be able to enhance and allow you to control objects in a larger area. It seems Yuito's Baki doll gift is a gift from everyone. Yuito, thank you for being a part of my life. I want to thank and you. that's I'm the way I have the Baki dolls. Because... 